on ISOCA UK TV in association with SMP Europe. We've arrived, we are here and we're ready to go. A third successive season at the top flight for Great Britain and they get underway tomorrow against the Czech Republic. Delighted to say I'm joined by the GB netminder Ben Bounds. Now Ben, it felt real today, didn't it? We were talking about that before, everything being set up, but, but today felt a real, real day. Yeah, um, the, the vibe seemed to really kick in today. I mean, there were a few things still being finished off around our dressing room and uh, obviously being built by the, the guys sorting it out here. So, uh, yeah, everything was pretty much finished today. And walking back from practice, I mean, even even when you first got there, even like the the other teams were on the ice in the main arena, we're obviously training on the training pad because you know that they're, they're getting ready to host the games there. And uh, then walking back, there's fans around in the in the jerseys, walking around, the fan zone across the roads going. So, yeah, the, I think the vibe's really kind of, Hit, hit in today and started kicking off. Do you feel really settled at this level now? It's a third successive season, as I mentioned there. You know, the first year was finding your feet, but you got that win to stay up. Last season was four points. Do, do you really feel that you belong at this level? Yeah, I, th I think we've we, we've known that we've belonged all the all three years really. Uh, I think maybe the first year we were a bit hesitant at times and we were waiting for teams to really kick in and start scoring goals. And when they didn't, we almost shocked ourselves. But no, I think uh, last year was a big turning point. Uh, this year is going to be probably a bigger challenge than ever. I mean, we're missing some some key guys. We've got some new guys and some younger guys, some less experienced. But it's it's going to be great for them. Um, and like John has said before, we left. Um, the, after the last game against Coventry, once you're out here, it's, it's one hell of an experience. It's, it's a lot of fun, but I think the most fun thing is is the challenge and stepping up to uh, step, stepping up to raise your game at the, to this level and keeping up with these guys at the speed. And it, it's not even thinking at speed; it's the processing speed. I mean, as soon as you think at this level, you're dead. So uh, you got to process process everything so much quicker. Uh, your feet have got to be um, in sync with your brain and your hands and everything. So it's it's, it's a lot of fun to play and. Uh, yeah, I think we've got to go in there. We've got to be confident. We know that we can cause damage, but we're also, we also got to be aware that if we switch off for a split second, uh, teams are going to cause damage to us, and we've got to be 100% switched on for 100% of every game. What do you expect from Czech Republic? I think only eight players returned from last year's World Championship. I don't think by their standards they had a, a great Olympics, that they weren't happy, then they made a few changes. I mean, they're still going to be formidable, aren't they? Yeah, I mean... Um the checks are the checks, right? It's, but you can say that about pretty much every team at this level. It's, it's going to be a, um, a high tempo game. Uh, the the passing is going to be on point. It's going to be snapping it around. We we know how they like to uh, move it on the PP five on five. How the zone entries work, uh, and, and everything's just going to be played at, at super high speed. And we, like I said, we've got to be 100% switched on all the time. We got to raise our levels, raise our speed, just to keep up and compete with them. Now you're in the practice ring today, but you've had a couple of chances to play on the on the big ice in the main arena. Have you got used to the ice? Do you know where the bounce is and, and bobbles are? What, what's the ice like? Well, it's, it's ice is ice, right? I mean, obviously you got <laughs> is the it cold. You got the sky dome and everything back at home. It's probably not class as ice, uh, but no, um, no. It's it's a kiss. Once once you get going, you get going. It's, the the game's the same. I have the same crease in every rink. I have the same net in every rink. The puck's the same size. I mean, yeah, okay. Each year players probably shoot a little bit harder and a little bit better and. Uh, you have to tweak your game every so often, but uh, at the end of the day, the, the game's a game. Uh, you you got to score more goals than the other team. You got to let less goals in than the other team, and uh, yeah, it's a rink to rink as well. Like if if the you get used to it as it goes along. Uh, we've only really had uh, what is it two sessions on on that pad now, and uh, no, it's obviously rimmed slightly differently to some other rinks I've played in this season, and obviously back in. Uh, the Sky Dome and stuff like that, it, it rims totally different to there. But no, the, the ice is good. We're gonna, it's, we know it's going to be chewed up uh, when we have the second games or the later games. It's, it's a hot building, but they always are in the, uh, the World Championships and it's going to see a lot of uh, skates on it throughout the week. So yeah, as the week goes on, I expect it to get chewed up just like it does every year, but you, you just get on with it and you never know, that might actually play into our favours. Not sure whether you've noticed this because you, you know you've got games to play and, and practice, but it's got a it's a great arena, isn't it? It's got a, a massive jumbotron. It's a really impressive facility. Yeah, I'd, I'd probably say it's a, the best arena that we're probably ever going to play in our lifetime. Um, it's going to take some beating. Uh, just just walking just walking to it, uh, you walk past and just the sheer size of it, it's huge. Um, but I mean, that's Finland's a Finland's a hockey nation, right? So any of the new arenas that they're building for this kind of event is going to be amazing, and that's exactly what that arena is. Yeah, absolutely. The number one ranked hockey nation in the world, and you can really feel it now. The tension is building. Today, you've just seen fans all around the rink, and tonight, of course, they'll play their first game. Plenty to look forward to, plenty going on. And don't forget, tomorrow, the game is live on Free Sports with Aaron Murphy and Paul Eddy. That's it for now. We'll be back soon on Ice Hockey UK TV in association with SMP Europe.